What's up, y'all? This is Mariah Israel coming for kind of like an update, but not really. I know the last one I did, I had my hair pinned up. So, um, this one, I took my hair down to wash it. You know, I had it pinned up for a month. And, um, I was thinking about going to get it retwisted, but decided against that. I think I'm going to try to either freeform or semi, semi freeform until somebody in. Somebody in the army that outranks me say something about my hair, but the only bad thing about it, that is I have to keep it pent or braided or some kind of way. And since I don't know how to braid, that means I'm going to have to go to my loctician or figure out how to do something with it or whatever. Um, I want to get into washing it more because I feel like that's prob my problem with the dandruff is that I only wash it once a month or whenever I go to the hairdresser but I feel like if I can wash it maybe once or twice a week or you know or whenever I feel like it it'll cut down on some of the dandruff or whatever um oh that's about it I know I'm not digging in my nose y'all I just was rubbing my nose like got water and stuff on my nose it's not digging in my nose it's not digging in my nose but um, what else? Um, I think on last video I told you I, I um changed my my eating habits to better to better me. Um, it's not a diet; it's just a, um a life a life change, I guess you could say. Um, doing more um natural um things, you know, not just on put more natural things inside my body, not just on my body. Um, after me doing a lot of uh, research and everything, I found out that um, it's a lot of stuff that we really don't don't need to do, but we do it. Like deodorant, really don't need no deodorant, really. Um, and if you do want to use deodorant, don't use the deodorant that you buy at the store with those um, antiperspirants because they clog up your pores or whatever. And um, your body needs to release those toxins, and with you putting that kind of deodorant on, it's not um, the body can't release its toxins like it's supposed to. You're supposed to perspire. You're supposed to sweat. That's how that's how your body releases your toxins. And you putting on that deodorant, all the deodorant is doing is giving you a good smell and clogging up your pores so you don't perspire. Meaning you, you won't sweat, but you need to sweat. You need that. Um, if it happens to give a smell or whatever, um, that's nothing but bacteria and um, baking soda will clear that up. So you get some baking soda, um, put it in your hand, wet it, slap it underneath there, and you'll be good. Um, so it's, I mean, I've been doing, I've been having more deodorant in like a week or so and I, I, I don't smell or whatever. Um, don't, don't smell at all. Uh, after smell good is is um I um smell what I naturally smell like I don't I don't base with any soaps that um well I, I've stopped in the past week I've stopped basing with soap that um has fragrances in it um I get unscented soap but the soap I get is um on um, Dr Bronner's bar soap I get the unscented kind. And I use Dr. Bronner's um, liquid um, soap to wash to wash my hair. But um, the reason why I got liquid soap to wash my hair is because I just recently bought um, the bar soap um, like, a, like like a week ago, and I been had the liquid, and I didn't know that they were pretty much the same thing. So now on, I probably just keep the bar and just wash my hair, and um, in my body with that, with that soap, with the bar soap. Um, I've been, I guess you say, been a vegetarian slash vegan for the past, going on three, four months now, I think, three, four months. I lost count. It's, it's becoming more, um, less of a, a struggle and less of a um, headache now that I've been doing it for a while it's it's becoming more I guess you could say part of my life now. It doesn't 
it doesn't bother me before I was, you know, fiending for for meat and fiending for this and fiending for that. But after you get past, I guess, I want to say like the first month, um, and you get your set, um, food, um, schedule, I guess you could say. I eat a lot of veggies and fruit. Um, if you want protein, it's there. They got soy, um, soy, um, stuff like that. They make soy, like you get veggie burgers and veggie dogs and, um, tofu, all that, and they can give you your protein, but I, I don't really get that so much. I just pretty much stick with vegetables and fruit. Um, um, I guess other than that, I mean, I'm still using my essential oils mixture. I'm not going to get rid of that. Um, I feel like that helps some kind of, you know, just when I feel like my hair is, is, is dry, just spray that on there. So I'll probably keep doing that for a while until I, I feel like I don't, I don't need it or whatever. But I think with the, um, I think until I can get the way I can wash my hair more than, more than once a month or, or whatever, I can get to wash it like once or twice a week. I won't need any other oils because the shampoo that I use, it has, um, I put essential oils in it and plus your hair gives it on, gives it, you know, it has its own moisture. Your hair has its own, has its own moistures and everything. So, um, that's about it. I still use Pico Locks, um, make your own shampoo mixture. Um, one thing I did different with that, um, I added a, Teaspoon, I think, yeah. Teaspoon of baking soda to it. It um makes the hair a little more bouncy and manageable or whatnot. Um and um that's about it. Um I think I'm due for a retweet. It's been a month, but probably won't go get it done. Um I got a four day four days off of work. I won't have to go back to work to Tuesday in between now. And then I'll be figuring out some kind of way to do my hair on my own so I can eliminate the hair salon altogether. I just need to, I'm not really good at doing hair, so um, I don't know how to braid my hair, to <laughs> tell you the truth. If I could braid, I would braid this stuff down pretty much every day. Take it out at night, braid it up before I go to work in the morning, but I don't know how to braid. Um... But I'm gonna try something out. I'm gonna get on YouTube, look at some 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 videos of some women's um doing some easy hairstyles or whatever, and um especially for my my length of hair, and I'm gonna get on that, and I figure out, I figure out something. If not, I just go to my salon and tell them to just pin it up. I won't um yeah if y'all hear that that's my phone. I won't um have her to wash it anything. I just go in there and tell her to braid it up and, and pin it up and everything. So. That's what that's what my my last resort would be to go to her. But um, like I say, I got tomorrow, I got tonight, tomorrow, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday to figure out a way to do it myself. Um, but until then, it'll be I'll be rocking it like this until. Shoot, I, I love having my hair down, so I I'm not in no hurry to uh, to pin it up again. I, I love it being loose. Loose. I would shake it for y'all, shake it a little bit, but it's still wet. It's wet. I just shook it a little bit and I got water splashed all in on my glasses. You probably can't see the water on my glasses, but there's water on my glasses. But enough about that. Um, I don't know what I'm going to title this. I guess I just tied that update. I'm still in my eighth month. My ninth month won't be until the end of this month. So the 28th of this month will be my, well, this month only got 28 days in it. So I guess if you don't, the 28th, the first, I guess the first or the second of um March will be my update because this month only has 28 days in it. So um depending on whether well, my hair is pinned up or down, I will make an update somewhere around that time. But um I guess I give y'all a look at it. It's doing a lot better. Um. The, the things I used to have problems with, which is the ends or whatnot, they're um they're still doing the same thing, but I don't got the way I don't care. They they they're just gonna do what they what they want to do. Um, and um 
Gonna try to do this 360 thing. So that's that's it, y'all. Um, that's my hair. So, um. Guess I'll holler at y'all later. About to... I don't know what I'm finna do. I don't have to work tomorrow, so I'll probably stay up late. But I am tired. But I don't want to go to sleep. So, I don't know. Well, hit me up. Um, what is, I think it's Wannyville. I know you should have had an update out by now, man. Really. You should have had an update. So, I, what, where's your update, man? Really, where is, where is your update? You should have had an update by now. I've been checking YouTube like once a week, two or three times a week. I see you liking videos, but I haven't seen a video from you. So you should be having an update video by now. But I can't say anything because people got lives outside of YouTube or whatever. So um, I check YouTube pretty much every day if I go to bed for people with their updates and everything, but, um, I just recently came into liking people who freeform videos, I don't know why I envy them people who freeform, I would have, I would freeform, or would have started my locks freeform, but me being in the military does not, so that's why I don't, I really need to get out of this military, because it's like, I feel like it's prohibiting me to be me, to tell you the truth, but, I got 20 months and I'm going to try to stick it out, um, but I'm still going to wear my hair, not exactly the way I want to wear it, but close to it until somebody say something. That's the key with the military. It's not wrong until somebody say something. It can be in all the regulations they got that is wrong, but until somebody say something, then you do it. And if you can go your whole military career with your with your hair any way you want or being out of regulations, what they call it, and nobody says anything, then you're good. But you got some people who who um doing this, um, you know, they they in the military to retire and everything, and their whole job is to learn all the regulations and everything, and it, you know all that kind of stuff. People who high ranking, you know, SARM majors and stuff like that, which they know the all the regulations. And you get you you run into some of them, and then they want to point out what's 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 the, what the problem is with you. But like I said in my other video, my hair doesn't doesn't have anything to do with my ability to do my job. I can have a bald head, I can still do my job. I can have a, a um processed hair, you know, the, the perm, the European look that that a lot of the, um. Um, black females, African American females like to wear. I can have that and still do still do my job, so I don't see what the difference is. But enough of me ranting, y'all. I'm finna go in here and eat me some apples and some pineapples and chill out and watch Martin on TV One. TV One is the best channel out there. I tell you, TV One and Centric. That's all I watch. If I'm watching TV, that's all I watch. But you know, peace out. Y'all bless. See y'all later.